A Scottish nursery has vehemently denied accusations of discrimination after Scotland's health secretary Humza Yousaf claimed his young daughter was refused a space there because of her race. During an inquiry by Mr Yousaf's wife Nadia El Nakla, Little Scholars Nursery in Broughty Ferry said it had no space available for their daughter Amal and two other children who had Muslim-sounding names. But the Dundee Nursery said it had space after responding to fake inquiries from three mothers with non-ethnic names. The SNP-led Scottish Government Minister has now called on Scotland's Care Inspectorate to investigate whether the nursery discriminated against his two-year-old daughter. Taking to Twitter, the Glasgow Pollock MSP, who is also seeking legal advice, said, Not a step my wife and I have taken lightly. After our nursery application for our daughter was refused a second time, my wife asked her white Scottish friend to put in an application for a child the same age. Within 24 hours of refusing our application my wife's friends was accepted. Mr Yousaf claimed his wife had emailed nursery bosses in September 2020 and again in May. Scotland's health secretary also claimed that three white Scottish applicants offered tours of nursery and spaces, often within less than 24 hours, while at the same time that applicants with Muslim names were being rejected, including application for my daughter. The health secretary continued, It doesn't matter what my position or how senior in government I may be, some will always see me, my wife and children by our ethnicity or religion first. We have given Little Scholars Nursery every opportunity for an explanation for the disparity in treatment, none has been forthcoming. Mr Yousaf went on to allege that they had uncovered what I believe to be a private nursery discriminating applicants on basis of their ethnicity, religion. He concluded, I cannot tell you how angry I am. As a father, all I want to do is protect my girls, yet aged two, I believe my daughter has faced discrimination. If this had not happened to me I'm not sure I would have believed it could happen in 2021.